Hello, I am walking in a park on my lunch break, trying to comprehend the Six Flags ride announcement today. Oh my gosh, I originally um, wanted to uh, do a reaction video tonight, but I knew I'd never be able to make it all day without seeing spoilers. So I just went ahead and watched the uh, the Six Flags ride announcement, uh, which I think may have came out last night or early this morning. Watched it when I woke up, and I was not pleased. Um, so before anybody says anything, I'm not being negative. I am just voicing an opinion. I'll get all kinds of comments saying, if you don't like Six Flags, don't go. Well. That's not the point. I love Six Flags. I have 50 plus videos of enjoying Six Flags. You are free to watch them. But over the last several years, their new rides, let's say, have failed to um, do anything for me. Um, so as I'm watching the, the video this morning, they start out with Six Flags Great America. They're getting some amazing new Awesome roller coaster, of course. Why not? They only have like 39 roller coasters. And then they show, you know, like a West Coast Customs for another park and another roller coaster. And I'm watching and watching and watching. The very last, they show Six Flags St. Louis. And what do we see? Supergirl. A modified Highland Fling, which they tore down earlier this year. And it's the exact same ride. It's got the same arm that goes up. The only difference is instead of being in a little cage, you're in the open air. I I don't even know what to say. I went on Facebook and to the Six Flags page just to see what other people were commenting and like 90, 95% of the comments were negative. So it's not just me. Um, so, I also want to say, why is it even named Supergirl? Uh, Six Flags sent an email confirming it's in the Britannia kind of medieval section of the park. So why is it named Supergirl? That doesn't fit in the theme, not that they have a theme, but another thing. So basically the last four years we've had Fireball, Spin Sanity, Typhoon Twister, god awful, and now Supergirl, a modified Highland Fling. Oh, my arm's getting tired. Hold on. <sighs> okay. I don't do very many one-take vlogs. So, this will be, from what I looked, we got the Boomerang in 2013, which was a recycled roller coaster from, I think, somewhere in Texas. And it'll be at least... 12 years since we've had a good roller coaster because the American Thunder came in 2008. So if we get a roller coaster in 2020, it'll be 12 years since we got an original roller coaster. I mean, I don't even know, I don't even know what to say to that. I'm just super disappointed. Of course they got me and I'm sure I'll be a season pass holder again next year. I'm already a member, but I mean, come on, I mean, no roller coaster for seven years, no good roller coaster for at least 12 years, another spinning ride, another spinning ride. We've had the Spin Sanity, the Fireball, which is just a spinning loop. Now this thing, another loop of spinning, it's the same thing as the Fireball. Only the Fireball, you're in a little car. Same, same exact ride. Why? I... Come on. I know Six Flags St. Louis might not be the premier park, but they got to do better than this. Their attendance is never, ever going to go up with this kind of crap that they're putting out. Maybe I'll be wrong. Maybe I am being negative. Maybe it'll be some amazing ride. I don't know. But if you have any comments, let me know. I just don't want to hear the, the part where I'm being negative when I'm only negative in like 1% of my videos. With that being said, I got to get back to work. May the adventure continue.